Although Excel 2007 has several predefined series, you can create your own custom series if you like. First of all, before you can actually create the series, you need to set a pattern of what you want that series to be based on. So let's say we want to create a series of every other month. So we would give it a, a couple items of data so it would be able to calculate that. Okay, so we have every other month, January through May. You want to make sure that you're on your Home tab to create your series, and then go to the Editing section of the Home tab. Click on the Auto Fill button, which is in the middle of the first column, and click on Series to open the Series dialog box. We got a couple of options here. You can choose to create your series in rows or in columns. We'll stick with rows right here. You can do a linear type of series, which means it will add a certain number. Uh, growth, which means it will multiply that number. Date, like we're using here, or autofill, which will just repeat the same pattern that you've already had. So it would repeat January, March, and May. If you choose linear growth, then you can choose the step value. So if you want to create a series for two, four, six, eight, and so on, your step value would be two. You can also um, choose a stop value, although that's optional. If you don't want to choose a stop value, then just leave that blank. So we're going to choose date, and we're doing month. So go ahead and choose month. Click OK. Select the part of the pattern that we've already completed and then drag down to autofill and as you can see it's going to give us every other month in our new series.